But Captain Silver on the mass system. This is this week's uh, mass system challenge from uh, 8Bit Boy UK. I've had a couple of goes on this the other day. It's going to turn that volume down just a fraction. Try to refrain from swearing because this game is a little bit tough. So, it's a little bit irritating. You know, it's nice enough, but we'll, we'll have a crack. We'll have a crack at it now anyway. So We'll have a go. We'll see how we get on. I never knew there was two different versions of this, the, the shorter American release and the and the other larger, you know you know, more fleshed out release. I never knew never knew I never really into this game. I played the arcade version on emulation uh, fairly recently. So I'd never heard of it. I'm pretty sure I'd never heard of it. Oh, I do remember Way back, seeing Captain Silver, and he knew it was a day to his game on the on the mass system. But by the time this got released, I sort of started to move on to move on to like the Mega Drive and stuff. Oh, what very good was he? Previous attempts at this, so I say it's probably about a third time I've played the game ever. Now, previous attempts, I think I got uh, got two. Was it the boss? Was it a witch or something? Was it some witch flying around or something? And then the other night, I, I thought, oh, I'll, I'll play the the arcade version, go on emulation. Uh, I still have a fan of the arcade. It's, it still looks pretty. Turgid is a term for it. I've got to say, I think the mass system graphics look a little bit better, a little bit more colourful in the arcade. Oh, now he's Mr. Peril. Obviously, it lacks some of the finesse of the arcade, this. But so he's pointless, pointless, trying to tackle this guy. I think he's supposed to be the Pied Piper of Amelie, isn't he? Because I think he's. Let me see, we got the pair up now, exactly. Without that, without that pair, it's a waste of time. <laughs> this is the only game that I know as well where you, you know you can get get defeated by a fountain. <laughs> you can get defeated by a fountain. I mean, what's all that about? I think someone's tripping. Someone's definitely tripping. I think they definitely put more than paraffin in the uh, in the in the room. Oh, pumpkin, I are. So that's another thing, so once you get that power up, you don't have the full sword swipe, do you? Well, anyway, look, this again is another attempt at the uh, the Master System Challenge uh, for people that are tuning in now. This was uh, recorded on live stream. <laughs> this is just repeat ourselves once more. Uh, this is the second attempt this evening. Uh, we'll, have, we'll have another go. On the Master System Classic. Yeah, I, I've got to say, I don't mind it. It's okay. It's okay. It's a bit, it's a bit of its era of its time. Probably this and the arcade. The arcade looks a bit, you know, for a 1987 coin op. I think data is. I don't know. I don't know what hardware they were using, but I think they needed to step up the game and stuff like Afterburner was out. And then you got, other stuff as well. Oh, fuck's sake. Just, ugh. It just cheeses you. I think this game does it cheeses you with stuff like that. It's a good. It's a good game design.
So where some people were hating on Quartet on the mass system, I think Quartet pisses on this from a great height on the mass system. He, he could rate yourself a quartet, I think you must have, I don't know, rather large turdy ones to rate yourself a quartet on the mass system. This is, this is middling to average at best to me. Just well irritating. Just because the sprites are big, you know. Music's jolly, I don't know. You take, you take, you a favourite. You turn a favourite. I, I am going to be scaring eBay looking for this one tonight. <laughs> but then again, that's it. It's, Again, with video games, much like music and films, it's all, it's all subjective, isn't it? Everyone's opinion. Why well, wouldn't one person like them? One person like it, won't they? So this, it should have dropped by now, shouldn't it? In a normal video game, it would have dropped, wouldn't it? Don't wait till like right under it and drop like that. It's just plain evil. What ah, Plain evil. Oh, and here we go. The water for the bloody fountain of doom. Captain Silver and the Fountain of Doom. It's going to run out of time as well. So if you die, you know, mean enough, it's going to kill you with a bloody killer fountain. It's got a bloody time limit on it as well. You're going to run out of time anyway, look. I'm going to have enough time. I'm going to run out of time now before I get to the boss. You watch. Do that. You know what I mean? There's another one as well, either. There's that which has it. There's another one, either. I think I've, I've defeated that one. Can you see how it's like bloody pumpkins? Oh, I should have had it. I should have had a drink before I started this. Definitely. <laughs> don't buy anything. Exactly. <laughs> oh, don't buy anything, especially off eBay when you've had a drink. Don't get pain. Don't get pain. Forty nine ninety nine for bloody Captain Silver in mint condition. What's with these things? What the frick? I got to them before, remember them bats before. Yeah, I'm quite happy with what I've got about 15 or 16 Master System games. And is it time over? Yeah, I think that's my time over with Captain Silver. Oh, don't, I've just can't get my head around it. It's one of them. It's. Poor old Captain Silver, you know, bless his heart, but he just ate, he ate for me, so again, that was my attempt at the Masters of Jan this week. Uh, it was fun, it was just fun. <laughs> and cheers, and anyone tuning into the Masters of Challenge, thanks for viewing. <laughs> Catch you again on the next Masters of Challenge.